So wait, what are we looking for again? I wasn't really paying attention when you told me earlier. Well, you remember when HQ sent that robot down to fix our fax machine? <laughs> How could I not? Fucking thing tried killing Miller before I wrestled it to the ground. Which was an error on my part, might I add. Should have let it finish the job. Yes, uh, well, the other day I remember seeing it in here, and now that June's helmet is broken, I'm thinking we'll just give her the one from that robot. Oh, here we go! Huh? It's perfect! Are you sure that helmet isn't that thing's whole head? I'm certain, Nicole! That'd be stupid! Everyone knows there's a robot skeleton face in here, like that one movie. Terminator? Yeah, 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 that, that's the one. Don't hurt yourself. I'll get it off, dork. <clears throat> well, I loosened it for you. <laughs> yeah, sure you did, Jim. Well, that's fucking awkward. I feel like this somehow violates all the things I consider decent. Let's just go. Turn it around. I don't want that thing looking at us. I'm not touching that. You do it. I would, but I'm not strong enough. Oh, well, I am. Here. Hmm. What? Oh, uh, nothing. Thanks. Now let's head off. Okay, keyboard jockey. Wait. Do you hear that? Yeah, and it's already giving me a headache. Maybe we should... Good. Everyone is here. I'm here. And Geff, I guess. Huh? Shut it. We have a situation. Fucking finally. Oh, uh, before we start, June, I got you a new helmet. Oh, uh, yeah? Yeah, check it out. You know I can't fucking see, right? Oh, crap. Yeah. Uh, here, let me swap it over. What in the... Best to just let it play out. <laughs> Ta-da! June, you can officially see again! Great. I can see... you assholes. Enough grab ass! Someone's sneaking around the base! What? Where? Yeah, tell me who, I'll fuck him up. We don't know where or who. We just know by the sound that they've breached the premises. I need to know who was on guard downstairs. Uh, well... It was Geff, probably. What? You said you were guarding upstairs! I, I was! She's lying! Her and Sarah were downstairs trying to fix June's helmet. What? Uh, no way. We were looking upstairs. Yeah, it was definitely Geff who messed up. No. Uh -uh. Yeah. Huh? Do you want to contribute here? Not really, but uh, if I gotta, I, I remember seeing Geff downstairs. How? We were literally guarding the upper level together. You couldn't see, remember? What are you? What are you talking about? I don't know what you're talking about, Geff. I've always had this helmet. You're literally wearing the new helmet they were looking for! Well, Geff, that's three to one. I can't believe you, of all people, would lie to me. M Miller, look at June. I mean, seriously. Geff, I honestly have no earthly idea what you're talking about. What?! Wait, 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 wait. So you knew that we had been breached, and rather than share that intel over the comm so we can commence a search, you decided to pull all of us together in a confined space where a single grenade could kill us all? Uh, well... No, 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 think about it. You may as well have just lined us up in single file and begged for us to all be killed in a brutal fashion. Are you a sadist or something? <coughs> <coughs> well, if you know so much, how about you call and report it to HQ? No, hold the phone. Now give the phone to me. You, the master strategist and five-time decorated asshole of valor with the brilliant thought to put us all in a position of extreme vulnerability, wants me to do his job. Aren't you always the one preaching about how if you want a job done right, you better do it yourself? Well, I think now is that time. I mean, what did you even do during the invasion war? You sure you weren't just the guy in the kitchen handing out sloppy joes and cleaning up even sloppier joes on the way out of the toilet made by the real soldiers? Oof, need some aloe vera to go with that, Burn. Yeah, get fucked, idiot. Huh? Just do it yourself, Miller. I've said it a dozen times. They don't respect me. Shocking no one. If not June, then one of you three needs to do it. That's an order. Well, I'm not fucking doing it. 
HQ said I'm not allowed to call them anymore. Uh, fine. I'll do it. Again. Okay, here goes. You know, for once I wish your post would live up to its name and legitimately have a blackout. <sighs> what is it this time, Outpost Blackout? This better not be that idiot asking for more work again. Um, no. This is Private First Class Sarah Dawes, and I'm reporting a security breach that tripped an alarm, but we cannot seem to find the perpetrator. Did we even look? Probably? I don't know. <laughs> don't be silly, Dawes. You're stranded on a floating platform in the middle of the ocean. I'm sure there was just a glitch in that godforsaken outpost of yours. The Lord cannot be bothered to bless that sinkhole, so I am sure you have nothing to worry about. Consider it fixed. Well, when you put it that way, sure feels like what we're doing here is important. Come on, Dawes. Oh man! So someone did slip past me. Yep, because you were the one downstairs, dipshit. R right. I do wish I remembered being down there, though. But if everyone else says I was downstairs, then I guess I was downstairs. Darn. Yep. Totally. Well, good going, Gaff. I would say I'm disappointed. But my wife killed every last feeling I had. And to be honest, I never really had that in the first place, so I guess... Uh, Go back to your stations. Hello, Pathfinder. Do you copy? Over. Affirmative. Did you receive the blood sample? Affirmative. Good. Make your way back to Relic Base. Balboa will be waiting for you there. Affirmative. Okay, guy. It looks like we've made contact. Alert the chieftain. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Aye, soldier. 